morning, everyone. My name is Israel, and today I'm presenting my RP work in progress. Um, to start my presentation, I'll do a little, uh, I'll explain a little of the my friends. When, when I started to think about my RP, uh, I decided I wanted to talk about media because it's my major and it's a subject I like. But in media, you, should, you have a lot of types of media. You have photography, web, cinema, printed media, and television. But I choose the television because of the media I like, I'm a, I like the most to study. Um, so when, when I thought about television, and Australian television, I needed to decide what, what would I talk about. And then I started the selection of my topic. And then I started to, to think, why do I know about Australian television? And ah, there is a TV drama that is very famous worldwide. It's not famous in Brazil, but I knew it anyway. Uh, that it's called Neighbors. And it's one of the most watched TV shows in the UK. So uh, I decided to, to study how the TV show Neighbors is representing Australian identity. But after a little research, I realized that the, just to talk about the TV show Neighborhoods is too narrow, and I wouldn't have references enough to do a great, to do a good IRP. So then I decided to refine the talk a little bit. And then I changed it to how Australian TV shows are representing Australia identity overseas. Uh, I get, again, I had a little problem with the overseas. Um, most of the data about it are not in academic research. I found a lot of data about the the, the Australian TV shows in the overseas, but not much in academic resource. So then I needed to change again to how Australian TV shows are representing Australian identity, both internationally and nationally. And I decided to focus my work on two suburban dramas, Neighbors, that was the one I've already watched before, and The Secret Life of Us, that I just uh, I started to watch here, and I like it a lot. So, um, it, it's important now for me to say that you, only, you don't only have suburban soap operas in Australia, you have also in another important soap operas, which are the rural dramas. But if I would talk about all this, uh, my work would be too long. So I decided to talk only about the suburban dramas. Uh, then to select my research, I started to search in the library. And I found some books and articles about Australian identity. Being one of them, very important, called Being Australian Narratives of National Identity by Carolyn Elder. It was wrote in 2007, and it's my my most important source. Uh, uh, more, basically, more than half of the data I have about Australian identity comes from this book. It's a very good and complex book. But another source I found in the library was this Contemporary, Aus Contemporary Australian Television by Cunningham and Miller. Uh, Cunningham and Miller are actually very important researches on Australian television and they have another they have an article they have an article that I found online uh, about the neighbors. So when I searched online I searched mostly for articles because uh, it's not right to download books and unless it's open. And uh, those are two important articles I found. Displacing Difference, The Secret of Secret Life of Us by Nola, work in 2009, and Neighborly Relations, Cross Cultural Reception Analysis in Australian Soaps in Britain. Uh, but I found some difficulties uh, during my process. For example, one of, the, one of the elder books in Australia was missed in the library, and the other two was on loan. So I needed to make a request and, and wait for the other person to return the book for me to pick it up. And actually I only had the book on Friday, but I already started to work a lot with it. And 
I have some difficulty in searching for a specific academic material about the TV shows, especially about New Yorkers. I have a lot of things about Flat Earth, but not much about New Yorkers. Uh, one of the difficulties for the decision is to rock rural dramas because I think they are important. Um, my number of words, because I only have 1,000 uh, 1, words and it's too little, uh, the last book in the library, like I told you, and my outline was a little too big, so I needed to narrow a little more. Uh, positive things that had was a help from a local, Alton Bryan. He had, he's graduated from Lydia in Flinders University. So, and he gave me a site to the Flinders University, so that's where I got the book from Elder. And the need is a new for watching the TV shows because I like them a lot. And two curiosities I found about those TV shows was that Neighborhoods was the most is the most watched soap opera in the UK and actually it would be concealed, concealed uh, a lot. Uh, much years ago, because it wasn't very popular at the time in Australia, but it was a lot popular in the UK. And thank you very much for listening to me. Sorry. And do you have any questions? <laughs>